Hello, I'm going to be showing you how I change my notes jewelry. All of my pieces are BVLA and they're all from Indigo Skin Design. I'm going to be changing it from my threaded piece here to a press-on piece. So I'll have to also change the post inside. Um, if I was changing to just another threaded end, I could simply remove this end and then thread another one on, but I'll be using a taper to change all of it. So what I always do is, because I always do this in my bathroom so I can be near a mirror, I always put a towel in my sink because I know myself, I know that I will drop something down my sink, so just to cover any holes. Um, and then I put a clean surface down like a paper towel or something to keep my jewelry clean. And my hands are clean and I'm just touching myself, so I'm okay with putting my thumb to hold the jewelry on the inside. So to start, I'm going to push up and unthread this top piece. It will just come off. So the piece is off. I'll put that down. And the post is still inside. That's where it would go threaded into. So at this point, if I wanted to change this with another threaded piece, I could. I'm going to remove it. And then I have a taper, which I will use, with, and now I have nothing inside. I have a taper which I will use to help guide the jewelry back in. What I'll be putting in is this piece here. It's a press-on, it's a flat back on the post, so I'll be able to keep my thumb on there to help guide it. It just pulls right out. The taper has a smaller pin on the end, which is what will go inside the jewelry to guide it through. Okay, so that just goes right in like that, which is great because now I can maneuver anything I need to maneuver. I'll get my jewelry ready. <clears throat> So what I'll do I'm gonna do this in my mirror so it's not on camera. There we go, a little easier for me to see. So I have the jewelry threaded into that small pin, or not threaded into, but just pressed into that small pin. So now I'll be able to guide that through. I'm going to take the taper away. So as you can see, now I have the end of my jewelry on the inside there. And I'm just going to take this end here that gets pressed in. And just grip it. Thread it in there. Like that. And then because I have the pressure on my thumb there, I can just push down. And it just pops right up. And you can hear it pop on and feel it. And that's it. I could also then likewise um, just remove this end, which just pulls straight out and put on another press end. It's very easy. If you have a taper and you want to change your jewelry, it's very simple. And I think the, the biggest thing is just outsmarting yourself and, you know, think of anything that you might do, like drop it down your sink or, you know, um, lose it down behind a cabinet or something. So um, that is, that's it.